We begin here at four with traffic troubles. This flashing stoplight causing concerns for metro neighborhood. The traffic signal set on flashing during a road construction project. News force Kaylee Olivas joins us from intersection of Sarah Road and Southwest 29th. And Kaylee, residents there say the now four way stop is inconvenient and dangerous. Yeah, that's right, guys. Although some of the residents that we spoke to that live nearby this intersection in southwest Oklahoma City say that the roads behind me were in much need of repair, they also say it's become hazardous to drive through it. Traffic lights, people don't always understand when the traffic light is red and flashing that it's treated like a stop sign. So we're stuck behind somebody, they're hesitant to go, they don't know when to go. You know, that gets very frustrating. Um, I could see maybe a potential collision happening there. Christy Richmond says her neighbor has already had a fender bender at this very intersection, but wrecks aren't her only concerns. A lot of people are trying to cut through, so they come through our neighborhood, they speed down our streets. We've got kids and animals, cars sometimes parked in the roads. The project doesn't just impact Sarah Road. All of Southwest 29th is getting overhauled. What we're doing is we're basically reconstructing Sarah Road to widen it so that essentially two blocks from 59th to 29th will be widened from two lanes to four lanes. And while that goes on, this traffic light will remain flashing red. The city actually reached out to us and asked us to turn it into a flashing red to make it a four-way stop just to kind of help drivers be a little bit more cautious of the construction in the area. I'm a little frustrated. You know, we weren't necessarily notified that they were going to be out to begin with. I would like to see it just get done as quickly as possible. Now, if you are caught driving recklessly through this area or any construction zone for that matter, the fines are doubled and you could face criminal charges. Out here in southwest Oklahoma City, Kaylee Olivas, Oklahoma's News 4.